Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. You know, if you work around people, and most of us do if we're working, or even if you're not working and you have friends or acquaintances that you spend time with, there's a factor out there that causes us to lose our credibility and also is kind of a virus that starts working in our own belief system that really works against us. It's called rumors and gossip. If you're in a job and there's someone in your company who seems to be the company black sheep that everyone seems to go to the water cooler and talk about, and you find yourself walking by the group that's talking about this person and joining in and then agreeing with them, you know, that's not only making you look bad, it's also working against your own belief system. You see, keep in mind, every time you say something, it's literally a manifestation. Your belief system, your inner conscious mind, that subjective part of your mind says, yep, and starts doing everything possible so you agree with that and you find congruity with that from inside. Even if you don't agree with a group and you're just kind of a chameleon wanting to be part of the group, your subconscious mind is going to grab a hold of that and you're actually going to start viewing that person differently even if there's nothing to justify it. Every time you say something negative about someone else, your own belief system believes it's the truth. And then it starts building upon that case and starts bringing up evidence and your eyes start going to the failures of that person rather than the good things about that person. Even in your own family. This can happen by allowing our relationships to fade away a little bit and start looking at our husband or our wife or one of our children as the black sheep or maybe that isn't who I thought they were when I married them. Even that statement alone will have you start looking at the failures in someone and start rumoring and gossiping in your own mind to create a case against them to make you right. During this time of year, it's easy to feel isolated sometimes. It's easy to seek company. As the old saying goes, misery loves company. I'm going to ask you to prevent yourself from making company with people who gossip and rumor about other people. It's not the right thing to do. It works against you. And I can guarantee you, eventually, it will come back to you. So be nice. Love everyone. And if somebody out there isn't exactly your kind of a person, just understand no one is the same. We all have our different model of reality. And you're not walking in that person's shoes. You do not know what's going on with them. And maybe that one thing we're gossiping about was just something that was going on with them that day that was not good. So let's take a look at that. Let's put some grace on that a little bit. Until next week, this is Dr. Gary wishing you a very ungossipy kind of day and enjoy your weekend. Bye-bye.